amid um, right, credible so terrorist me, threats. Please. All right, Dave, All right, Dave. go ahead, Thanks, take right, it. Thank you. We've got some eyewitnesses as you, Mike, why don't you stay on, show the pictures over here, and I'll talk to the eyewitnesses. You can look at what's going on, the firefighting efforts. efforts. We had a couple people who were in the Pentagon at the time. Tell me what happened. Uh, we were sitting at our desks um, having a meeting, and there was a, a large uh, shutter, or there was a shutter of the building, and the uh, sound of a large thud. Right, you could hear the, uh, the, uh, the impact, and there was a large concussion, like an explosion would, would do the air, would be, be a concussion. But well, we didn't know there was an explosion. We just, it was clear, we looked at each other and knew that something catastrophic had happened, but we had no idea what it was. Uh, people began evacuating immediately. Um, and uh, went outside, and it wasn't until we were outside we realized what had happened. How far away from you in the building were you when it happened? Well, if you divide the building into fifths, um, five pie slices, which is the way the Pentagon renovation is scheduled, this is in the first wedge, the new wedge that just was finished, and we were in the next one over. Did you see any injured other than the ones who were out here that we saw? I didn't see any injuries. Did you see what size of plane it was when you got outside? No, just but walking um, up here now um, along the road, you, there are pieces of aircraft uh, spread all the way up the road, um, at least a third of a mile from, from the impact site. What goes on? Can you tell us what would happen be in, in those offices, generally speaking? I know you can't go into great detail. Well, we're looking at the E-ring of the Pentagon, and that's where uh, uh, the more senior officials are. Uh, that area, I believe, is where the Army Deputy Chief of Staff for Operations and uh, the Army Deputy Chief of Staff for Personnel's offices are. We're looking here also, I believe, I don't have a monitor, but I believe you're looking at one of the injured being taken away by Arlington Fire and Rescue. They've been on the scene since a few minutes after this happened. And I mentioned before, but the firefighters and police officers on the scene here have all been warned, keep a close look at the skies, watching for a possible second attack as what happened in New York. Mike and Andrea. All right, we're going to.